Hi guys. Uh, my name is Mustafa Talib and here I'm with you to go about rendering these spheres here with a plugin or let's say script called the Shading Network Generator. Uh, you can download it, you can see the, the address of the web log and also the very main site which is creditcrash.com. Uh, so I've, I've I've put you a written uh, file there in order to install it. Although it is very simple, you can just copy it and bring it here into your shelf. But if you need the icon, you must copy it into your bitmap category of uh, Maya. So uh, here I have uh, four spheres uh, with the background and also a very simple lighting setup in order to make the basic visualization smooth. Uh, so let me see the, the, the render. This is a render. I'm going to change it just within some minutes. Okay, so good. Let's paint hyper shape. So you can see uh, nothing is there regarding the spheres. So I go to run the a script in here I type the very core name so I type for example will be simple say spheres underscore and I have the very basic channels color transparency regularity activity diffuse and the other uh, channel also a ray trace for, for visual also glass or transparent uh, materials so I go to uh, ramp connection setting uh, if I if I'm going to use ramp for color, so I must uh, turn it on here, so it will gray out. Uh, I did for specularity activity in order to show you the very process, and I go to color ramp setting. This is something you know. Country everything. So let me explain. This is color ramp setting. So any any change being applied to this part would eventually influence on this channel. So this is also called color ramp setting in order to be formative enough. I I, I apply it and you can see three ramp colors uh, with a greenish tone have been created. Uh, so here fact I'm going to make it uh, a green so at the edge you can see it's to the edge but I'm going to make this one at the edge so let me make it a little bit like this a little bit like this like this I got the specular ramp setting I'm going to make uh, in fact two colors because the, the presets are not yet complete I'm going to change them so I just I would use uh, to color and apply that, we change it. We change it right here just for a moment. Done. So, here we do sample everything as well. And only let's three if we did, and we apply them and get to be created. This is the very basic workflow. Dirt material is part if you have any dirt material, you can select it here and, and heat get. Uh, the dirt. So I don't need it right now. So I, I I just do not turn it on. If I hit this 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 field here, it turns on, and I, and I can kind of do the editing. Okay. I I I go over it. I I go to the bottom and produce the network. So you're gonna see it's been created. Very simple. Let's say tutorial. So I just if I Sign it there. This one, this one. Of course, I'm going to make changes soon. Let me render it. Okay, you're gonna see this is this is the uh, image which is being made. So let me just make some small changes there. Uh, I'm going to create a Lambert and signs. So, I think it's 
comes in this mode, what it does, that's the very poor it is really. So I also minimize this and go to the So you're gonna see. Uh if you change them uh, let me go to the presets place it and oh sorry and change it like this. You will see how it appears to be. Uh so now if I render it you can see the change made. Of course, more reflectivity in the part here. Uh, see the lighter and also what is peculiarly on the attach this one thing constants. Pop up just has to appear there. So I go to eway and you'll see this very strange shape which has been there. So so this will quick be made there and I'm going to render it. So just stop uh, recording in order recording in order to not waste your time. Uh, okay, here you have made some very simple renders out of this plugin. So you can, for example, go to duplicate shading network and uh, you're gonna you're gonna for example in the, the glasses, you're gonna for example uh, Change it with some colors there. there. Some more specific time render and for example the time of the this one and this one. So uh, let's let's take a render to see the final result. So you see the final image very simple. And I'm working with the script is more simple and more simple even than this image. Uh, so I hope you've enjoyed it and have learned something useful. Uh, see you later.